Hello oh, bitches, hi guys, welcome back to part 2 of my Supergirl 508 reaction video. If you haven't checked out part 1 of this reaction, make sure you go click the link in the description box below to watch that one first. Otherwise, let's get right back into this episode. I'm so bloody stressed, it's a joke. It's... I, I can't even... I, I can't... I can't talk, okay? Just watch my part 1 and you understand. Anyways, part 2, let's go. Okay, you want me to use a known threat to stop an imminent one. Handing <laughs> over a global Q-wave projector to a terrorist? I know you think what you're doing is right, but she is our friend. Yes. Yes, she if is. You Claymore, then... Alex, come on, Alex. What the fuck? Oh, okay. It's an earthquake. It's fine. Melina is my friend too, and now all I... of a sudden I'm supposed to decide whether I should risk everybody's I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. I know. Threatened Kelly, and now... I, I'm just supposed to trust him. No, but I get it. What's on the line? You're the one who taught me how to do this job, and you're the one who's had to make really tough decisions so that people don't die. You have every reason. To I so get that. See, that's what the thing about Supergirl. Alex un explaining her point of view and where she's coming from. I totally get that. She's the head of the DEO. She has to make life or death situa uh, decisions every single day. And this is like a huge thing. And like, you know, a Pompeji point, as she said. And Lena, like, doing it with... Like, she's got to decide shit. And it's a hard. And she's got to not think about Lena being friends. She has to, you know, she has to think about all the other people in the city. Like, I totally get it. But Lena, <laughs> like, but I get it. Oh, I hate myself. Okay. Yeah, my brother. In nine minutes, our defenses will be disabled. Do you want me to delete it? <laughs> My God. I can reposition the dishes myself. We discuss this absolutely not. You could be killed, both Hope and Eve. Yes, gone yes, yes, yes. We don't want that. For both of us. You're the only friend I can count. Stop, Lena! Don't say that to me. I'm not your friend. <laughs> I'm something you created to serve a purpose. This is the only way. Oh my God! Oh my god, what is that? Percent chance Mirad will be neutralized and a point zero one percent chance Lena will surrender. Which makes it a virtual certainty Lena will not survive. Oh don't say that to me! You let him know that if he so much as smiles, I will have a dozen agents in their guns pointed directly at his heart. Ms. Luther, we are locked and ready to launch Mary. Don't do it! Amazing how we've done it. Don't smile, Lena, it's not funny. No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Okay. Yeah, but you have to! Oh my god, stop it! This is too bloody stressful for me. I can't deal. Someone, we need to stop. We need to stop this. This is too stressful. I can't do it. I can't do it. Now you bullshit piss off. What well, times are changing, old man? Okay, it worked, right? Oh, thank God! Oh, thank God! Thank you, John! Yes, they can! Piss off! Yes! Finally! Let's kick his ass! Oh, yeah, Queen! Go off! Oh! Yes! I stand. Oh, Andrea! Go off! What did she do? Sometimes the good guys don't win. Oh, honey, I feel my heart breaks for Lena, man. My heart actually, she is a good guy. We know this, but like, honey, stop. <laughs> She's, oh my God, we just need her and Kara in a room together to talk it out for real. None of this bullshit. I need, they need to actually talk for real. Like none of this hologram shit. Oh, please, look. Something to say about this. Who do you think appointed me? <laughs> I can stand. What the fuck are you doing with that? I'm sorry, I failed. I see. What the? <laughs> oh! It wasn't her. It was me. Oh my God, Lena. Miss Luther, you all right? 
What a sneaky, what a stand. What a sneaky, I could stand. It's fine. You okay? You know Lena. She's not gonna stop. I know. We need to talk to her, please. She's alive, thanks to you. You were right about saving Lena. That's Malphic. right. That's right. Well, if we can save Malefic's soul, maybe we can save Lena. That's exactly right. The content uh, I need. That. Oh, stop. I'm gonna get emotional. What the fuck? Oh, no. Why am I crying? <laughs> Fucking Andrea and her bloody boyfriend. <laughs> He's really cute, though. <laughs> that's actually really heartbreaking. That's just a deal to see him. Like, that actually makes me heart. That makes my heart break. I finally did the right thing. I'm just sorry that it's too late. I wish I could have saved you. I know. Me too. <laughs> why am I crying? Oh, please, it's Cara there! I can't see through my fucking tears! Oh, I'm going crying! I can't fucking see the screen! Oh my god, look! Look, look. oh my god, it's so fucking gay! <laughs> Um, yeah. <laughs> what? You know what? They th I don't even look at my best friend's photos like that. <laughs> I look at boys I like like that. I look at Casey Cod like that. I look at Kevin Carroll like that. I look at Matthew Dario like that. That's love, bitch. Fuck, fight me. Oh, and her rainbow socks. Gay rights. Wow, Kara said that gay rights. Can we- Why are you sitting there? Go and speak to her! Sorry, I'm getting annoyed. Why are you sitting there? She has to brood. She has to, like, you know, be sad first. Can we just go see Lena, please? Her name is Magan. Oh, she's Magan. A friend of mine. I love her. And she's a white Martian resistance fighter. Now I think you can bring peace to Mars for the first time in hundreds of years. Yes! I love that for him. Do it. You were meant to be the promise. Oh, that's cute. I love that. Oh, his spaceship. Not a scratch on it. <laughs> I'll do my best. Well done, John Jones. What the fuck? Bitch! A bitch! No, 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 no. What does he want? But he brought him back for. He brought him back. Uh, Malefic. Why did. Why did I want to do that? Test. Yeah. Your brother. Okay, now interesting. Now you have faced those demons, you have come to learn your vulnerabilities are your strengths. Interesting. He was, now you are ready. He was preparing him, right? For crisis. Ready for what? For crisis. Bitch, kill me. Oh my god, I knew he was alive. Piss off! This is gonna cause some shit. Because then when Lena finds out, when Lena finds out that he's not actually dead. Maybe things will happen. I don't know, but I I don't know. But I I knew he was. I knew he'd be alive. I knew he wasn't dead. I knew he was alive. Time has come for you to fulfill your destiny, Lex Luthor. You can now become the hero that you have longed to be. Oh my God! I've always been the hero. How are you having? Happy to help. <laughs> I don't trust him. But first, we have to discuss my sister. Oh my god, don't touch her! What the fuck is that? You gonna leave me like that? Are you joking? What the hell? You saved my life. Submit and begin your life anew. What? Show me. Excuse me. The no oh, what is that? What happened? What the fuck? Where'd Nash go? Oh my god, stop it. Woo! It's coming, bitch! It's coming! Oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm so fucking nervous. Okay, so that was an amazing episode. I still, I actually thought they were gonna, like, fix 
Lena and Kara is like, they were going to, you know, fix it. And it was going to be okay. But it's not. And now I have to wait till next year. Because, like, they're not going to talk about it on Crisis, right? Or maybe they will. Because I know that Lena's in Crisis next week. She's in, she's in the, the first day. She's in Crisis. So, I don't know what's going to happen. But, like, why did Lex say, let's talk about my sister? What the fuck does that mean? I want to know. Don't touch Lena. You understand me, bitch? So I'm getting really angry. I would defend my wife, you understand me? I would defend her with my life. Um, But, like, why did Lex say that, though? But, like, okay, let's just talk about the episode first. Oh, my God. I cannot believe they left. They did that car and Lena, like, looking at each other's photos thing. That is so love. That is so romantic. It's so gay. I don't, let's, this is the tea. I literally don't sit on my bed or, like, in, in in my house. I don't go to my house. I don't look at photos of my best friend and, like, get them. I don't do that. I don't look at it, how she looks at it. I, I, like, I don't do that. I look like... I would look at a photo of, like, my ex-lover. Like that. Like, remembering the memories and shit. I would look... I'd like, come on, please. This is bullshit. <laughs> this is the slow burn I deserve, but let's be honest, I... If they don't make them canon after this, I don't know what I'm gonna do because they. And is it just me? It's not just me. It's all, a lot of other people are seeing that it's a there's a romantic undertone. Like you, the way they do these scenes, it's how like a West Allen scene would be, or like a, an an Elicity scene would be if they were going through a rough patch. It'd be that type of music. The background music's like you know. It's like a breakup. You know what I mean? It's not even. It's it's like main couple thing. Do you know what I mean? Am I crazy? It's literally like that. It's That's what it feels like. And I'm not stupid. We're not stupid. We, everyone sees it. It's like... Don't do that. If you're going to if you're gonna make them canon, then okay. But, like, don't make these scenes seem romantic or have romantic undertones. If you're not going to do it, you know what I mean? Like, don't do that to the viewers. That's why I'm really, like, on the edge. I'm like, I don't know what I'm gonna, what's going to happen. Like, are they playing us? As a joke, I don't know, but like I'm, I'm intrigued. Oh, they better make them kind of fucking swear to God. Anyways, uh, but that was an amazing episode. I understand all their points of view. Kara and Lena just need to hash it out and talk. Even so why? Are you, like, just go and talk to each other. And I, I understand when Alex was coming from with like the virus and stuff. Like, I get it. She has to think about the city and like she. I get it. She has to make those tough decisions and those tough calls. So I get it. So I don't even know what's gonna happen. Nothing's resolved, kind of, not really, but I'm still stressed. Um, and I don't even know what's going to happen. So, um, yeah, that's my reaction. Um, what do you guys think? Um, <laughs> let me know in the comments below. Um, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for a Batwoman reaction, which I've been told is going to ruin my life again. So, prepare yourself for that. And I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow, as I said, for Batwoman. Love you guys. Ciao for now. Bye.